Okay, here I am again. Musa Matt Meacham Jr., the author of over 150 books, uh, more than 150. But here I am here again on at 500 Boston Street, and I'm here to give you another lecture. And at this very moment, I, I'm, I'm trying to figure out what I should, what should I lecture, lecture you about. I think something like, I got something very curious and very personal that I want to share with the world. It's in the medical profession. You know, okay, oh, here I am, okay, all right. I don't mind talking about it. And I hope and if you got any children, don't, don't, they shouldn't be listening to me right now. I'm not going to say anything, any bad words or anything, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to talk about a very serious subject. Okay, you know, uh, when men get old, you know, like I am, I'm like, I'm 72 years old, so that, that means that I'm an old man and certain things happen to old men's bodies when they get my age. Oh. And one of the things that's, that's happened to me is that I'm, I'm one of the, well, I, one of the, I, I guess it's uh, at eight, I, I guess about 80% of men in the Western world have this issue when they get this age. And uh, it, it's called, it's a prostrate issue. In other words, when men get a certain age, they prostrate, it gets larger. And it makes it very difficult for, sometimes he, a man may run into retention or something, and sometimes it's very difficult for him to, to, to urinate. So I had an issue. What happened was I, I um, went to see my doctor, and I said, look, will, will you give me some type of, uh, okay, I was having an issue with one of my testicles. I was looking down and I said, wow, this thing sure has get, gotten large. And that, it, that, that indicated I had a, a infection. And I said, wait a minute, but I told you guys, I had gone to two, two of the doctors. I said, I, I told you guys that I was having issues. And why, and why did you allow me to uh, get, go to this point? And the doctor said, well, we can't, we're not supposed to give uh, what they call them anti, antibodies in this case, because if we gave you the antibodies and you didn't have real bad symptoms, then your body may be, may become immune to the antibodies. I was, but wait a minute. Oh, I got a large testicle that I don't, and I, I, I've never had a large testicle before. In other words, my left testicle was larger than my right testicle. And I'm saying, what is this? I got one testicle large, and, 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 and I went to my doctor screaming. I said, what, what have you guys, I've, I've gone to two doctors, and you allowed me to get an A large testicle and, and she, oh boy they, they were very, very very nervous and so she said yes she my doctor is a, is a female so she said why don't you it's, she said we can't give you an antibody unless you have a, a, a serious bacterial infection I said what I told you two weeks ago that I was having issues and now my, my, my left nut is, is almost big as a peach. And she said, now, nah, okay. Okay, now. She becomes symp symp sympathetic. She said, well, I, what I need you to do is take another urine culture. She said, look, I'm gonna give you these, these hot, this, this wipe. And we, before you pee, she said, wipe your pee hole three times and then pee. And then we need to see a, 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 a sample of your culture. I said, wait a minute. What do you need to see a sample of my culture? I already told you, I got, I got one left nut that's bigger than it's supposed to be. What? What? It, it, the medical profession? You're supposed to let the nut get big before you... My goodness, what is going on in the medical profession? And now she says, I get a call from, from, the, from, the, your, your, the, from the radiology department. They said they want to see me tomorrow. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna stop right here. We'll get we'll get to this later. We'll get to this later. Uh, I'm gonna sign off.